Adrian and Arian, thank you for talking with Innovating Smart today. So tell us, uh, Adrian, what is your full name, um, the, your title, the name of your company, and what is the innovative thing that you're doing? And then tell us what's compelling about that to you. Uh, my name is Adrian Brozell. I'm the CEO and founder of Zenano. What we do is we do uh, great water filtration recovery for commercial laundromats called Washington Hotels. Uh, it's interesting to me because it's sort of an environmental business. Uh, we save water, which saves the environment, and also provides a nice economic return for our customers. So it's really sort of a win-win for everybody involved. Absolutely. So, what is your next big goal that you face at Z Nano? So our next big goal is to really get into uh, making a lot of sales and really increasing our manufacturing capacity. So, so you can service those sales. Yeah, so we can service those sales. Yeah. And um, are there any systems integration challenges that you face? Uh, I think the biggest challenges you face are more in customer attitude and uh, sort of customer understanding of what the opportunity is. That's because over the last year we've spent a lot of time figuring out the systems integration challenges and have now sort of gotten it down to a really quick, simple process that allows the customer to be evaluated in a period of about two hours. Awesome. So. Great. So you, so you had challenges, but you've overcome most of the big ones. Yeah, I mean, I think systems integration is an often overlooked challenge in any sort of project. People sort of chalk up as to, you know, it'll take three months. But in reality, it can take anywhere between 18 months and four years. Right. And, and you said um, customer attitude. Is it, is it uh, because the, the water filtration system that you offer is not a standard part of the commercial operations that yeah, you're... Yeah, people think working? that sort of water reuse is for the big guys, right? The big customers, the GEs, the Boeings, the Lockheeds, the Intels. Not necessarily for, you know, a million mid-cap business. So that's sort of the market we're looking after. So we have some attitudes to change that. And my final question for you today is, what advice, if any, do you have for other people doing innovative things? I'll let Arian answer that. <laughs> Be prepared for a lot of sacrifice, more than you, more than you realize. Yes, yeah, I've I, I heard that before. <laughs> it's, it's more true than you thought. You've heard it before, but take it one step, one step further. Yes. Uh, the, uh, all the more reason that um, I find, and this is why I, I talk with people like you, that people doing sustainability-driven innovation are really, are really our heroes today. So thank you for that. Thank you.